If I had to describe my cooking style in three words, it would be simple, seasonal, and traditional. I think uh, seasonal cooking is something that I learned very young as a chef. It was important to all the chefs that I worked with that we bought stuff from local farmers, which meant that we bought in season. I just love traditional recipes because there's a story there that goes with your food. And all the food that I cook is simple. Some of the best food in the world is just starts with great ingredients and then keep it really simple so that you really celebrate those ingredients. There's really just five main ingredients, which are the flour, the sugar, the eggs, milk, a little bit of vanilla, and the blueberries. My mother grew up in France, and this is this clafouti recipe is something that she got from her family and that she showed to myself and my siblings. So this is definitely a recipe that I think of when I think of tradition. And uh, the reason that I wanted to make it and the reason that I thought about making this dish is because it's something that I see my kids making now that they love to make. I guess my mom could be described maybe as, as a real uh, healthy eater and she was really conscious about the food that, that she cooked. And so she would grind her own flour. And um, I think if you asked my siblings, was mom a great baker? We would probably all say, eh, I don't know, because she had this this habit of cutting about half the sugar out of all the recipes that she would make. So as far as cakes and pastries, um, I think uh, they were just okay, but the bread was just wonderful and she made it almost every week. And so I just remember that as growing up that we always had fresh bread. I think one of the things that is important when you're trying to get kids interested in cooking is give them recipes that it's easy for them to make mistakes on and they still Come, up, come out with a product that they can eat and enjoy. And uh, this is just a really easy recipe. And it's adaptable. You can make cloth tea with different kinds of fruit, uh, depending on what season you're in. Most really great chefs will tell you that you're always better off to buy locally. Beyond the feeling of giving back to your community and supporting local farmers, which feels great. It's the idea that the quality of your product is just better that way. And, and that, that's how it began for me as a young chef, just understanding that the closer we are to our source, the better quality ingredients we're gonna have and the better food that we can make.